The authentication page allows for the configuration of the type of authentication along with any data required to successfully authenticate your connector to the associated application or resource. This can be found just under the settings section on the connector's overview tab. Currently, Connector Builder allows for four different authentication types. None, which means no authentication required. Basic, which will pass a Base64 encoded string comprised of username and password, along with the word basic in the authorization request header. OAuth2, which will make use of client ID and client secret rather than exposing a username and password. This also allows for the configuration of different scopes the connector will request in order for the connector to perform the required actions against the connected resource. With OAuth 2.0, the connector can be configured for hard-coded values or to allow values such as client ID and client secret to be entered when configuring a connection within Okta workflows. Currently, authorization code is the only grant type supported for OAuth 2.0. The last one, custom, which allows for the specification of any fields that might be required to connect to a resource, for example, an API key. And just like our settings configuration, a preview of the connection card can be shown over to the right.